Welcome to this tutorial on how to make drop biscuits from scratch. Drop biscuits are a quick and easy treat that can be whipped up in no time and in this tutorial I'll show you how to make them step by step. Start by preheating your oven to 425 degrees Fahrenheit. Next take a large mixing bowl and combine two cups flour, a half teaspoon baking soda, a half teaspoon salt, two teaspoons baking powder, and one tablespoon sugar. Now add one half cup or one stick of cold cubed butter to the bowl and use a pastry cutter or your hands if you don't have a cutter to mix the butter into the dry ingredients. And you want to mix it until the mixture is crumbly. It's going to almost look like um, sand, coarse sand. If you haven't used a pastry cutter before, I find that it makes the job a lot easier and I'll put a link to the one that I'm using in the video description. So if you're interested in seeing what it is, you can check that out. Next, pour in one cup of whole milk and stir until the dough comes together. You're gonna have to stir it a little bit to get it together. It's gonna seem sticky, but just, just keep working with it. It'll be fine. And a little bit sticky is okay. Next, you want to line a baking sheet with parchment paper or lightly grease it with butter, or if you don't have any of the, those, then cover it in foil so that the pan doesn't get so bad, and then just spritz it with some olive oil or something to, um, to keep it from sticking. So you want to use a spoon to drop the dough onto the baking sheet, and I usually take a tablespoon and just do a heaping tablespoon, and you can see in the video about what size that is. If you make your biscuits larger, they're going to take a little bit longer to bake, and if you make them smaller, you're going to want to check them sooner so that they don't burn. If you don't want to leave them bumpy like they are when you first drop it onto the pan. What I did was I just kind of patted them down so you can see that they're they're not really shaped like they would with a cutout biscuit, but they're a little more uniform. So you can do whatever you want to do with this. So I, maybe mine aren't a true drop biscuit, but it's the same thing. So once they're on the pan, you want to put the baking sheet into the preheated oven and you're going to bake for 12 to 15 minutes or until the biscuits are golden brown. So you're looking at the top to see how they're changing color. When they're done, take the biscuits out of the oven and let them cool for a few minutes before serving them and you want to enjoy your delicious homemade drop biscuits with butter, jam, or honey. And these biscuits would be a good side dish for my mom's homemade vegetable soup. And I'm going to put a link for that here in case you haven't seen that video yet. That's it for this tutorial on how to make drop biscuits from scratch. Thanks for watching and happy baking!